Shalom to all our Rambam News viewers. This is our very first English newscast from Rambam Healthcare Campus. So let's get started. Welcome again. Everyone who visits Rambam can see the enormous progress made on building the West Campus. Construction of the final phase of our multi-year development project is well underway. Construction has begun on the Eyal Ofer Heart Hospital, which is adjacent to the Joseph Fishman Oncology Center. The skeleton of the building is being covered as we speak and work on the interior has already begun. Construction of the Helmsley Health Discovery Tower, which is adjacent to the Heart Hospital, is also in progress. The 20th floor tower will be constructed in collaboration with the University of Haifa and will also include floors for the Technion. In further news on developments at Rambam, the inauguration of the most advanced oncology radiation therapy center in Israel. As part of the ongoing momentum and exciting developments at Rambam, we are happy to present the new radiation therapy wing in the Joseph Fishman Oncology Center this facility was inaugurated in an impressive ceremony attended by the Deputy Minister of Health, Rabbi Yaakov Litzman, and the Mayor of Haifa, Mr. Yona Yav. The newly inaugurated unit will provide the most advanced oncological treatments in a superior environment. With 4,000 newly diagnosed cancer patients annually in the north of Israel, you can understand the urgency to open the doors of this vital new facility for treating our patients. In the inauguration ceremony, the hospital CEO and director, Professor Rafi Biar, gave special thanks to all our supporters and friends from around the world who helped make this very important project a reality and introduced Professor Irit ben Aaron, the newly appointed chair of the Oncology Division. We end our new cast showcasing Rambam's global impact with a special item on our pediatric emergency team Rambam doctors from Ruth Rappaport Children's Hospital train Kenyan doctors in emergency medicine. The Rambam team traveled to Kenya in collaboration with the Technion Global Medicine Unit, where they taught the local healthcare provider teams about the most effective emergency care methods and advanced resuscitation techniques for children. The team that traveled to Kenya in the collaboration returned home with great memories and enormous gratitude for the opportunity to advance the cause of healthcare around the world. That's it for our first English newscast. Today's newscast and items can be found on our Rabam website and our social media, including Instagram, Facebook, Twitter and YouTube, where you can of course comment, share and like us. See you on our next news edition. Thank you.